Okay? Yes. Don't hit my dog. You understand that? No, no, I'm not hit hitting. My I, dog. I am not hitting your dog. I was trying. Just one. Yeah. No, no, I was training here and your dog attacking me and I had to self defense. Mm -hmm. What can I do? No, I don't want a problem. Oh. It's my baby. No, uh, no problem. No, uh, I have no uh, fight. The next time I'm gonna kill you with all my family. No, here. don't kill me. I don't want to fight. I don't want a problem. Uh, Master, can you speak English? Can you speak English? Um, I was training here in the park and they dug the first come close to me uh, and after they dug is attacking me no, no, and no. then I had to self-defense I did a guard and I defense from myself the dog attacking me to beat me yeah. and they come and they start to just uh, make a problem with me and now they come back and threaten me if you touch my dog we will kill you because no they have a dog I am training here in the park yeah. I'm really sorry, I'm sorry, but I'm tired of racist case in the Belgium. What, what, uh, Even I am not free in the park to train in. I am peacefully training here for myself. You stay here? Yes. Oh, identity what for? I'm from the police. Okay, no, I have no identity card. My house is here. Yes, and for my security now it's in the Facebook live. If it's okay. Okay, I don't, I don't record your face. Yes, I was training. No, I cannot. I cannot. No, no, it's my, it's for my, it's for my security. I'm from the police. You have to. Okay, but I don't know what will happen later. I didn't do anything Sir, wrong. Officer, I ask you now to shut it down. Can I tell you one thing? No, just shut one it now thing. Down. I was training here. Shut I did it do off. Okay, okay. I was training here in the park. And uh, I didn't see that couples, this couple. And then uh, it was the one duck. The duck is came for attacking, and I know when duck is attacking or when it's just barking. And I had to do self defense, and I had a fight with duck, so uh, I could save myself. And then after I saw this couple. They come and they just uh, starting to make a problem. Mr. Swat, if you see this video, this man, he said, I'm a kickboxer. Probably he, he was one of your students. I don't know. I say, sir, I don't want a problem. I don't want to fight. I'm just training here in my, my own world. I'm just on my way. I don't want a problem. Your dog attacked me. I had to self-defense. And then uh, they start just to make a problem. I said, I really don't have a, any, I really don't want a problem. Please just leave me alone to training. And uh, yeah, when I saw, just, I tried to, I did, I did the best I could to just finish the problem. So it's just, <sighs> They went and then after, yeah, the woman, she started to saying that your training is not so strong. And so I said, because I'm a student. Yeah, I was trying the soft part, but it's okay. <laughs> after about five minutes, uh, 10 minutes, I don't know. I was just on my exercise and the, the woman came back alone and she come close, sitting close, close to me, very close. And I just stand up. I was sitting, I was training my hands. I just stand up and I stood up and say, excuse me, just leave me alone. I'm training. She said, I want to talk. I say, please leave me alone. I realized she is searching for trouble. So during the, this time, when I wake, I stand, stood up, she just uh, starting to threaten me. She say, if you touch my dog, I will kill you. And say, again, you started. Your dog attacked me. So, uh, when I saw two person is walking here, as you see in the last video, 
yeah, everything. <laughs> yeah, I'm really tired. It's really living in the forest of Belgium is is very very difficult. I have to isolate myself from the uh, government official racist. I have to isolate myself from the people racist, and even I'm not free in the park to training. Twenty years living like this. Yes, I'm really tired. Someone hear me? I'm really tired. And uh, it was of one man and one woman. The woman, pro, yeah, she said she's a police officer. And she didn't give a right to me. I say I'm recording. She didn't give a right to me to continue the recording. You saw it. You saw it. Welcome to Belgium. King Philip, welcome to Belgium. Please listen to me. Living here is almost impossible. There is no way to escape to just you live in your own world. It's really boring. And when I had to shut off the video, I say to the police officer, I say, officer, already I opened a file for complaint for your police department of the guns, okay? Excuse me, police department of the guns, excuse me if I didn't let the Belgian dog bite me. Excuse me. If you are regret, you can come back. You know, you know me. I'm here in the park and you know me, <laughs> you know my house. If you are regret because you didn't arrest me, because I didn't let the dog, Belgian dog, bite me, yeah, come arrest me. No problem. I'm not going to self-defense, no problem. I'm living like a prison 20 years in this country. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. You see, this is a life. Here is in the park. Here is in the park. Here is in the park. I am just here, training, and I put my stuff here to training. I'm not angry. I'm tired. I'm really tired. King Philip, I'm really tired. I hope you hear me, you understand what I'm telling. Please forgive me. I have so much respect for you. I am tired. When I shut off the video, I said to the police officer, normally when they dog attack me, when I had to self-defense, when they came, they should say sorry for what happened because they are responsible for keeping their dog. She didn't say anything. Yeah, even she didn't let me to continue the record. Why? When you want to hide something, always you do mistake, always you do crime. And the only thing I did, I just say to the police officer already, I have a complaint from police department of Gans and Belgium. I told her, maybe this help, I don't know. But I am tired. Because we cannot have a, even the minimum right. They dog attack me. They should say sorry. And when the police officer come, when I tell her, when I told her, she should say, oh, yes, you are right. I'm sorry. They should say sorry and so on. But no, no, no. She said, just calm down. Welcome to Belgium. No, I cannot live like this anymore. Seriously. Five years, like a captive in the Valoni, and 15 years under the hardest torturing, and I don't know how I am still alive. Praise Jesus. God bless you.